Good morning, Churchill class, and welcome back. I hope you had a lovely, relaxing holiday. Hope you enjoyed yourself and you're feeling really refreshed and ready for the new term in 2021. Um, today is the 5th of January, Tuesday, and it is 2021 now, so we're gonna be starting our new term. We're gonna be starting with online learning, so something very different to what you were doing last term but something that's so, so important right now so that we're all staying home, we're all staying safe and we're keeping ourselves healthy. Okay, so just give it your very best efforts. Try your best with all the online learning and you should do great. So you're gonna have a daily briefing for me today and tomorrow to go through what you're gonna be doing and you'll have all the details on your parents' email as well that you can look at. And if you need any more information, you can always email the year six email as well. Okay, so for the first lesson, it's gonna be an English lesson and you're looking to identify the features of a balance argument. This is gonna be our new unit of writing. So I've inserted the um, website link to BBC Bite Size. It's gonna give you a clip to watch the video and you are going to then use that video. You might want to make some notes about it, what's happening in the video as well, um, to write your cold task. So you're going to be writing a balanced argument on whether people should climb Mount Snowden. So all the information is going to be in the video. You can write down maybe some reasons why they would climb it and why they wouldn't climb it. And from that information, you're going to create a balanced argument, okay? And then for your maths lesson, you're going to be looking at multiplying fractions by integers. Okay, remember integers are whole numbers. So we're looking at multiplying fractions by a whole number. So on your email, you will have the website link as well to White Rose. You should have been using this before. You should have seen it. Um, you're going to go on there, watch a video of the PowerPoint, make sure you pause at the times they ask you to, write down things that you might help you. And once you watch the video, you can complete the worksheet, which I've attached in the email as well. And you can mark your own answers using the answers which are also attached in the email. Okay, so go through the PowerPoint. Any questions, you can always email, um, but have a go at doing the worksheet and marking it to see how you've done. Okay, and then the last couple of tasks you've got to do today is to complete the spelling quiz on Purple Mash. So that will be on your to-dos, to you know how to do those ones. Um, complete a comprehension task on Read Theory. Most of you have gone into that before already, so you should know that. Um, you've got all of those logins at home as well. And then the last one is just to read a book for 20 minutes and write about the main character. So whatever book that you've taken home for the holidays, or it could be a new book that you've started at home, I want you to read for 20 minutes and I want you to tell me all about the main character in that book, okay? Once you've done all of those tasks, you can send me pictures of them. You could send me um, attachments if it's on a Word document and send them to my email for the year six email and I can give you feedback and I can mark and go through them, okay? But all of that information is going to be on your email as well. And if you have any other questions about it, you can always email the year six um, email as well for any other information, okay? So that is today's lesson. You've got math, you've got English, you've got a bit of spelling, reading to do. Um, and then just try and enjoy yourself for the rest of the day. Make sure you move around, don't sit at the computer too long um, and just really give it your best shot today. And then I will see you back tomorrow for another daily briefing to tell you what you'll be doing for tomorrow's lessons. Okay, so like I said, just give it your very best shot. Obviously it's very different to what we've done before but we just got to try our best with this and know that it's so important what you're doing anyway because you are staying at home and you're keeping yourself and everyone around you safe and healthy. Okay, so I will see you back tomorrow, Churchill class.